Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we're back with part three of our Paint with Number series from DIY Moonshop. If you don't remember, we are working on Dawn from DIY Moonshop. She is one of the new Paint by Numbers that DIY Moonshop has come out with. So we are going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to try to finish this section. So this time lapse might be a little bit longer than the other ones but I promise not to make it too long because after that, it, it just gets boring. So with that said, let's go ahead and get started. Everybody. So I've learned to do voiceovers. Yay. So, uh, spoiler alert, I did not finish the session. Now this time lapse is actually recorded over a couple of days, um, just mainly because I have lifing to do, I guess. Um, so I recorded the first part of this segment, which you'll, you'll, you'll realize, you know, when the day changes because the lighting will change. Again, sorry about that window. One day I will get curtains to put up so that the sunshine doesn't shine through on all my projects. Um, but yeah, so I ran out of time the first day I was painting it. And then I had to come back the day that I'm recording to put it up to uh, finish out part of the section. I thought I could, but there's a lot of confetti in this section. So it is slowing me down a little bit and trying to make sure I get all, all the intricate lines and trying to read the pattern. Again, if I had one suggestion, it would be to add more numbers to uh, the legend so that it's a little bit easier to read. But other than that, I'm having so much fun working on this paint by numbers. And yeah, so enjoy the time lapse.
so if you couldn't tell this is where today started um each one of these time lapses is about an hour long but today when i recorded i actually ended up doing like an hour and a half i cut out a lot of the excess stuff like you don't need to watch me wash my paint brushes or uh whenever i would go to turn the channel on the tv because of course i was had to have some kind of background noise but the day has changed i closed the blinds because the sun was just it was too bright and it was being kind of annoying and part of this segment you're going to see my hand kind of disappear it might not be until later on but in part of the segment you'll see my hand disappear and i do apologize i only look up at the camera at like every five minutes and apparently i missed the part where you couldn't see my hand so if my hand is out of frame at any point in time i do apologize again if i'm talking super loud i also apologize because again the inner ear thing don't worry i'm about to get it checked out but again there's a lot of confetti in this section forgive the curly hair again I am still like rocking the fro right now and I'm not realizing how big it is because it's grown and I keep getting it into the frame of things so I do <laughs> apologize. I think I had the same thing happen in Bling Bling Bear's video as well. So yeah.
that's all the time I have for this week. Um, I think we got a lot done. So thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about this paint by numbers or anything else, please leave those down in the comment section below and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Remember, it's hard out here in these crafty streets, so please be safe. Wear your mask, wash your hands, don't touch your face, keep your six feet, and always try. Be kind, be courteous, be cool.